ladies and gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Today we've been called by the Missouri State Highway Patrol. We have a passenger truck, a pickup truck. I know it's weird that we would be taking the rotator for a passenger vehicle, but they said it is approximately 100 yards off of the roadway into the woods. A rollback's not gonna have enough cable, may not have enough winching power or strength to pull it out, so we're gonna take this. That way we know for sure that we've got enough rigging to be able to reach it and enough power to be able to pull it. I do not know injuries or otherwise, so as always we do ask for prayers, good thoughts, well wishes for all involved. Uh, it's on a two lane road, so who knows what we're going to get into. Here we go. Okay, we should be getting pretty close. They said it is just south of this intersection.
down there. Is it? Oh yeah. Well, when they said as far as it was, that's why I decided to go ahead and bring the big truck just in case. How far are we down there, Sheriff? Oh my goodness. We might have to go fishing. Are they okay? For the most part, he's back in the ambulance. Goodness gracious. Where, where's the mule team? Come on. No doubt. Oh, they're wanting to come real bad. No doubt. Wow. I need an excavator. Hey, Mike. <laughs> yeah. I need a crane. I don't. Well, we kind of, kind of got that, but. Just bring it down the hill. You'll make it up. I, yeah. Uh, yeah, and tear these people's yards up in the well, process. Oh, you won't bury it for one. Right in the middle of this freaking curve, too. Yeah. Ugh. Do what? I don't have a skid steer, but I have access to one if we need one. Whose property is this? Okay. Hey, Terry. I don't know, bud. Do we need traffic control? If we need traffic control, I can get dad down here with our traffic control truck. Oh, we can do it. But if you guys got other stuff, that's why we got that truck. You know? Oh no, we're good. I see a tire here. That's not good. Which way did he come down? I guess. I don't see tracks. I don't, either. I don't see tracks. I don't see a damage path. Holy cow. <laughs> And they said minor injuries. My goodness, he got angels flying with him on that one. He come through, oh, it come through here. Here's the damage path. It came through here, looks like. Went off there and. A little bit more and would have been a water rescue. Yeah. Is this your pickup or? Cousins. Okay. They said he's okay, I yeah. guess, for yeah. the most part. Yeah, so far, I don't know. Not me, uh, my goodness we got no obviously got no front tires we got this big thing under here that all kind of fluffed in the stage right? yeah. yeah i can't there's no <laughs> no airbags went off none yeah that's kind of not even side impact nothing yeah and no, i said it see I, i'm more worried about airbag than in the crash myself <laughs> I've never crashed with an airbag before, so. Goodness gracious, Mike. We gotta figure out our, we gotta get a recovery path here. Uh, yeah, I thought I was taking only, the only clear path we got, the longest. Yeah, unfortunately. Do we know who owns the, the woods here? Uh, I can tell you real quick, hang on. I got an app. Okay. <laughs> I got an app for that. <laughs> Well, I'd like to be able to grab the back end, but with no steering, we really need to grab the front and be able to control it out. And all this new digital stuff, you just can't put it neutral anymore. Uh, no. Yeah, that's that, well, hard. one thing about it, we're gonna have to get that big, uh, definitely gonna have to get the big truck on it. This is not a rollback job, is it, Mikey? No, sir, no. By no means. Nice well, I think he took most of the thorns. Oh, there was a fence, wasn't there? There's fender. Okay. We can redirect off of this tree, Mike, to get it started up this way. And then, which way do we go from there? Cut some of these little trees and bring it up that way. Yeah. Or bring it up through here because once we redirect it through here, it's going to come towards this tree. Yeah, we'd either have to redirect it again off of those and pull it over pull so that through. it comes up. We also need to check with the property owner. Yeah, see what, what we can do. Ma'am, is this your property? Yeah. It is. 
we're just trying to figure out our different options and what we can do yeah that's it yeah this is ours there's a fence row down here somewhere so he's probably he's on the other on side there, his side which is ben and right. i can get a hold of ben okay if you need me to well i know i can get a hold of his mom and dad what our okay. what our first concern was we were thinking unfortunately it'll as it comes out it'll tear part of the yard up and i don't want to do that but uh, I thought if we could set up in your driveway, uh -huh. we could bring it straight up through those trees. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, whatever you need to do is fine. But then it's gonna, no matter how we do it, whether we set up on the road or if we set up in your driveway, it's gonna tear up part of the yard. Yeah. So whatever works best for you. That's what I said. There's no way to get it out without going in the yard. Okay. So, I whatever. just want to make sure you're okay with that as property owner. I, 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 I don't. And if you're not, we will make another plan. We'll we'll have to work it from the highway, which makes it a lot more dangerous. But yeah, I'll, I'll go ask my husband. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Well, it may be before we're done. Hopefully, it holds off. Hey bud, we're working right now with the property owner to see if we can just clear this all out and work from their driveway and bring it up that way. It's too soft to drive down there, isn't it? Oh heck yeah, it's too soft to drive down there. <laughs> unless we get our uh, long, unless, long unless we get our full wheel drive pickup and go down there, but then you're still gonna tear the yeah. tear up some of the property. But my my concern with that was, you know. How we far get off. On there? We may have to add to it. My thing was want, not wanting to get in this blind curve and be here for an hour, hour and a half, two hours trying to wiggle it through all the, all the woods. woods. He did it good. Hell, man, he did. Uh, but if they'll allow us to set up in their driveway, I'd much rather do that, wouldn't you? Okay. Yes, ma'am. He said that's fine. Uh huh. There has, before we moved here, there was gas tanks here. Yes, ma'am. Around this pole, right around here, he said that was buried. Okay. Just so you know that. Okay, sure. Okay. I mean, I we- I want them all the time. <laughs> well, we could even set, we might even be able to set up here, Mike. Because see, he's saying that right here's where the gas tanks are. That's okay. That's been buried. Oh. So that's his concern. It was okay. before our time, but- Gotcha. They've told us that somewhere around here, there was a gas station, and I do remember when I was a little kid, a gas station. Okay, and all right. Very. I understand. Oh, I got you now. So I got you. Worry, kind of about that. I was thinking about propane tanks, but you're talking actual no, gasoline. Gas, yeah, 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 yeah. A yeah. Gas station here. Okay, all right. Before our time. Uh. Um. If my if my grandkids want, can they run down there by there and look? before you start pulling it up. Yes, ma'am, I have no problem with it. Uh, they're your, they're your grandkids, it's your property, so. <laughs> I, well, I didn't want them getting in the way, and I didn't want them. No, no, we're, we're still trying to make sure, as long as you're okay with us working off of your property. That's fine, just have Yes, ma'am, gotcha. I think that's our best option, don't you, Mike? Yep. Get up in here, winch it through the trees there, and at least get it out of the, out of the woods. Literally, get it out of the woods. And then we can worry about either bringing yeah, it up over here, over here pull it up. right that we're way we're tearing the we're not tearing up the, the biggest part of their yard correct <laughs> all right property owners giving us permission to go ahead and set up kind of where you're at what we're going to do is we're going to run that big truck and run a line straight down through the trees and try to bring it out through the hole it came all right. and then we may resituate over here and then again, we may not. If it's just coming up, we may just keep on bringing it on up. I don't know. Uh, but that'll keep us off that dead gum blind curve with no shoulder. And that'll keep all of us in in a safe zone rather than being out there on that highway. Right. Uh, Here's my flipper truck over here. Yeah, yeah. That, and I'd much rather work from the safety of a driveway and risk property damage than I would risk one of us getting hit out there on that blind curve uh, that's in a bad spot a really bad spot 
All right, well. Hey, guys. Hey, where are you guys going? have just a solid chain hook up on there rather than a V bridle or anything because that's gonna be a harder pull than just a standard uh, standard bridle is gonna handle plus we're gonna need the extra length I believe don't you Just enough to counteract the boom. Thankfully, I just re-spooled this last week. Oh, it's all right. I'm on downhill slide now. <laughs> what happened? I just got heavier. How much cable we got? Can you tell? I think so. We're not gonna have enough though, are we? That's it. That's all we got. Is that yours or mine? Yours. Mine, thank you. We have no cable left, but to bring it in back in a little. Yeah, it'll it'll wind up as we uh, take up the slack. Here's where we need our extra length of cable. Holy crap, Ola. Yeah, go ahead and bring your rigging down. Yep, what do you want, what, uh, what do you want me to grab? Uh, whatever we can to grab a hold of the truck. And then uh, we're gonna need some chains to get through this uh, through this timber. We may just have to cut as we go. Oh yeah, I love this saw. That's like your battery powered stuff on your fire trucks. Yeah, we ain't got no battery powered It would be really nice. Where you want to go? 
Well, it really needs to come off that stump there. Oop. That stump out of there first. Help watch my truck. Okay, people ask a lot how far the uh, remote will reach. I got 250 feet of cable. Then we've got another 80 feet of uh, chain, probably, and uh, straps, and the remote is still working. We're going to pull the stump out from under here first. Watch yourself, Mike. You're not in the path, are you? All right, stay clear. It's bringing a truck with it. Yeah, as long as it pulls it around. I was hoping to grab a hold of that front end though. But that way I could lift the front end so it doesn't dig into their yard as much. Yeah, we got been over that. It's pulling it down off of that one, but it's digging into that tire if it was in neutral yeah it might roll underneath it but yeah, i bet you it would yeah watch your chainsaws what do we look like on that other side uh, how far is it dead gum thing oh, up in there. oh it's stuck up in there too Cool. Okay, I'm gonna let off. I'm gonna grab it. Here, I'm gonna let the that. pressure off. Yep. Yeah, let's uh, grab that, like you said, and redirect it over here. Let's we'll see if we can spin it out. Twist it out. See if we can spin it out. Yeah. All right. In theory, it should. Yeah. See if you can unhook her now. I'm working on it. You need more, Mike? I can take some out on this chain up here too. Watch yourself. Huh? See if my chain, see if my saw will come out. Go ahead. Give it a yank. There we go. I think the tree's gonna come with it. Not really what I wanted, but. Shame. All right. 
got the saws out of the way. Okay. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're down. Down yonder. Still hooked up? Do what? Still hung up on it? Oh, yeah. And watch yourself in case it does that. It does that? Hey! We kind of want it. Well, sort of, but. All right, go ahead and unhook that, Mike. Yep. All right, is their cable coming in or not? I don't hear it. I hear it. Yeah, I hear it spinning. Oh, I don't have it pre-spooled. Or I don't have it locked in. I was going to say, I heard it. The, the drum's spinning, but I didn't see, uh, see it pulling in. There she go. Oh, we lost something. Uh, What'd we lose? Uh, uh, like your... Lose my side? Dag gum it. Do what? Hook came undone. I got you some extra there. You get it? Okay, I'm gonna snug it up. Stay there and watch it for me. You gonna stay? Okay, here we go. We're pulling. Chainsaw. Chainsaw. Darn it, Mike, you can't even get the tailgate down with this thing like that. To throw the tire and throw the tire and wheel in there. Yeah, I was pushing it yet, so I mean. Well, it's locked. Is it? Yeah, it's locked. It's an electronic. You can't even get the yeah. daggum tailgate down down. Yeah. That sucker's heavy. Yeah. I don't know, can we throw it up over there without tearing it up or not? Yes, no, maybe. Yeah, I so we don't need yep. to call them in. There, hold on. Let me let the let me let the winch out a little yep. bit. <clears throat> okay. Watch your step. It's still got a little bit in there. Ooh. I don't know if we can do this or not. That's crazy. It won't come undone. That's crazy. You know what we could do? Roll it out of the way, get one of the chain links out, and drag it up, hook it to the front of the truck, hook it to the truck, no, hook it to the truck and just drag it out. Yep. Yeah, we'll do that. That's good idea. Because right now the tailgate's salvageable. Yeah. We don't want, it's almost brand new truck. We don't want to tear it up any more than we need.
Ah! Oh, through the chain. Oh. You all right? Yeah. Uh, oh. what, the guys, the guys that did that one that caught on fire down there. <laughs> Left a heck of a mess, didn't he? Heck of a mess, boy! I can't believe that. All right, stand clear. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and winch. That would have to be mine too. Get it up here far enough to where I can redirect and bring it through these two little trees. I hope. All right, I'm gonna go up and free spool, Mike. Right. Just leave the remote down here. Actually, I may may just let you re-rig. Yeah. Let me show you what I want, Mike. Right. I'm gonna free spool it, and then take. I'll drag cable out. Take as much chain as you can loose and get as close on that V as we can on this side of the tree. I want it to come right through here, okay. okay? And then once it gets up far enough, you can holler at me to stop and we'll tie that tire and wheel to the front of the truck if it's got the toe pins or whatever. All right, here, might as well throw this up in there. You clear on what I want done? Yeah. Okay. Switch, switch on what side of the tree it's on and get as tight as I can. Take, take as many chains out as we yeah, can. Take out. Yep. I'll free spool it and we'll take out as many chains as we can.
all the edge straight. We're the opening right now. Dog going, Terry. Oh, watch your hands, Bubba. Let me get down here to the hook and my That's good, Terry. I think. Yeah, that's all I'm gonna get. Which is a lot better than what I had.
Come on, you. The dang vines are everywhere. Now, there went the aluminum rim. I got the chain, I just need manpower. Come on, you. I got her now. All right, just grab that aluminum rim, what's left of it, and throw it in bed, if you would, please, sir. All right. Going straight up. Going straight up. Property owner gave us, gave us the green light. All right, here we go. I gotta take pictures for the sheriff. More pictures. Brand new, isn't it? Or it looks like it. Leather interior. Nice truck. Man, it was a nice truck. I like that two-tone interior. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Got the big 6.2 liter in it. Like I said, she's out of the woods now, the worst of us. Now we got to figure out how to get it loaded over that, uh, their tie system. You ought to be able to ramp your bed over there. You can turn sideways in the driveway and uh, ramp your bed over that little yeah. rail tie well there's one there's one spot where there it's, there's where it's open there. It's yeah open. yeah i think that's where he went through at actually yeah it is if it's where i think you're talking about pretty sure that's it well i wish we can get that dead gum thing in neutral but yeah it's not Yeah, I know. With that, that push or that turn knob drive, you can't do much with it. You can pull the drive shaft, but yeah, it's in such a bind. Yeah, you lucky you don't get hurt trying to do that. Go for it. Thank you all. Appreciate it. Oh yeah, we got this. Oh yeah. Unless something lets go when she rolls back down, but it shouldn't. What's the odds of her making it that far twice? Oh.
Try to get a little lift on it. Make sure we're gonna miss that phone that or that utility pole. Trying to lift on it so it doesn't tear their yard up as much.
take this chain out and go direct to that. Turn your tip over. There you go. Can, hey Mike, can you get to it there with the rollback? Mike. Can you reach it from there with the rollback? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Well, let's take this and we'll use the wrecker to load it in the bed. Well, yeah. There we go. Uh, come on, baby. Yeah, it's close enough, close enough, close enough. Watch your head, Mike. Coming up behind you. Take her short. Okay, ready? Coming down.
And of course, it's going to go all the way out of your way. Okay, snug her up. Yeah, you're going to have to block it off of here. Pull it up a little bit first. Yep. Little bit more. Little bit. Whoa. There you go. Yeah. Yep. There we go. Don't want to listen to me. Say it, bring it right around. We'll be alright on the front side. Well, hold, oh, hold. Oh. If it won't, you can pick the bed up yeah. and pivot under it. Now let, let that on, just leave that on the bed yeah. for now. We have to, we'll get the saw out, we'll chain it, or chainsaw it. What well, sucker's heavy? There you go. Now just come back a little bit and pivot. Instead of going forward like normally do. Yep, because you're right at the edge of there. Just pivot it back just a little bit. Turn hard left. There you go. Little bit more. Whoa, there you go. Can you, can you get something under the other side? I was going to say a block. Throw that on the bed, or in the bed, so we don't leave it in their yard. Yeah. We can just uh, use it like a lever to cut, uh, pick it up over the edge of that bed, we'll be all right. Run your board long ways. Put it, put it over the edge of the bed. It's over the edge. Okay. All right, stand clear. Hopefully it'll hit that block and ski up it. 
Nope. Well, put now put you a block under it. No, what? Yeah, put put your block under it where it's catching on the bed. Clear? You out of the way? Yep. All right. Now we got it, I think. That did, that's what we needed. There's your board, yeah. Yes, it was. Oh, what a mess. Where's your chainsaw? Uh, That's all right. I'll get it. Just tell, just point me in the right direction. Side box right there. Goodness, my goodness. <laughs> okay, got it. <laughs> yep, I'm wrapped up in them, so I'm just stay I'm staying still so I don't trip. Ladies and gentlemen, she's up on there. I'm gonna sign off. As always, we will ask for prayers, good thoughts, well wishes for the for the driver. Apparently, he did go to the hospital. Uh, head injuries, no airbags deployed, which is very, very strange. But uh, our prayers will be with him as well. As always, thank you for watching, and God bless.